Space Fighters. It's yellow, but can change colors when necessary. Number two, miniature double screen cameras create the illusion of invisibility. Open slits through the Space Fighter in order to avoid shots that are bound to be direct. Number four, all crafts are equipped with emergency ejecting seats, plus gliding gear built into the soldier's uniform, plus an extra parachute built into the uniform as well as the seats. You have two parachutes rather than just one. Number five, one man spacecraft but can hold multiple people when necessary. So the double screen cameras are essentially a camera that projects an image and can receive an image as well. So if you have two sides of a craft and you want to look invisible, one side takes in the image and the other side projects the image. So you end up seeing on this side what is being recorded on this side and vice versa. So they're double cameras. They project and take in visual image. Thus, if it's small enough, it will create the illusion of invisibility. Very simple, very straightforward. We already have the technology, so why aren't we doing it? Anyways, the craft kind of looks like this. It has open slits in order for, well, in the case that a rocket is about to hit the plane, you can maneuver it properly so that the rocket goes through the plane in one of these little slits. This is roughly what it will look like in terms of shape. This shape is perfect because it allows for the craft to fly like an airplane when inside the atmosphere and to also be a spaceship when outside the atmosphere. Our military is to be very modern. There's nothing glorious about buying airplanes that are 30, 40 years old. The days of buying broken, unrepairable crap is over. We will have the best technology for our military because they and all of us deserve it.